Hello, this is Brandy from the Grand Forks Public Library. Today I'm going to be making a page in my art journal. To get started with art journaling, you'll need some kind of journal or sketchbook or notebook. And for today, I have laid down some washi tape onto my page and I'm going to be using watercolor to fill up these geometric shapes. I'm using a Koi pocket field sketch box, which is a little plastic case that contains watercolors and a watercolor brush print. I like to use watercolor brush prints. I find them really easy and fun. You fill the handle with water and then you'll squeeze it to get the water to come out. And then you're basically able to watercolor like if you were just drawing by hand. So I'm going to start laying down some colors in these geometric patches. And now for the fun part of peeling off the washi tape. And now I have a nice background to start my art journal page. So my goal for my art journal kind of is just to document daily life in a casual kind of way. Um, I can just sit down with my art journal and not feel the pressure to spend a ton of time on it or energy just to make art more often every day if possible. I have a few pieces that I'm going to be gluing on. I will start off by placing this partial stamp right here. My theme for this page is going to be centered around mail. In the last couple of days I've mailed a few packages and letters to friends just to send a little love and a little fun out into the world. I'm going to start by writing today's date. on drawing and doodling and adding little elements in just with different markers and pens. This will be my finished art journal page. I hope you guys take a stab at art journaling. You can put in as much effort or as little effort as you want. It's all up to you. It's just a nice way to kind of have a little break during the day. Have some me time, if you will. And I hope everyone stays well and thank you for watching.